Accepting donations as a small streamer can be either your only or your main revenue source and uh, that is why I'm in mean, today's video going to be going through exactly how you right there can create your very own website, donation website where you can accept PayPal donations, so let's get straight into it. Also, a little note here, if you find this video helpful, then please be sure to leave a like on the video, and if you see, if you want to see more tutorials just like this one, then make sure you subscribe to the channel with the notifications bell on. So there are multiple websites where you can accept donations, and some of them are safer than others. In today's video, I'm going to be demonstrating the tutorial on a very safe website. It is known worldwide and everything, so and then it is called Streamlabs. You may be heard of it, they have collabor collaborated with OBS and stuff, so it's a huge company. Anyways, uh, go to their website, which is, which is called streamlabs.com. If you don't want to search for it, I'll leave a link almost inside of the description. So go to streamlabs.com, obviously. Then you should come to this page over here, and you're going to click on login. And here you want to select which channel you want the donations, uh, donation alerts and everything to be associated with. In today's tutorial, I'm gonna be demonstrating it with my YouTube channel. So, I, I only have YouTube, but if you have a Mixer account, use like Mixer. If you have a Twitch account, then it's Mixer, basically, then Twitch, basically. But yeah, use use like which channel you have. So YouTube. Then you obviously want to log in. Uh, I'm gonna cut it in the video right now. When you have successfully logged in, this should be your first page that you see uh, on, on Streamlabs and. The first thing you want to do from here is go down to settings, down over here under my members or well, under the account tab over here. Click on settings. This should take you to this page with and already now you see PayPal. So obviously uh, you want to hit PayPal and here you can connect your PayPal account. If you don't have one you can create it. It's, it basically takes only 5 minutes if it's free. Uh, if you don't, uh, or if you aren't allowed to uh, basically create an account for PayPal, then you can maybe can ask someone you know, or ask a, your I don't know some someone close to you if they have a PayPal account that you can borrow. Anyways, click on con con connect if you have an account, and this will take take you to the PayPal uh, PayPal like website basically. Here you type in your email and your your country slash region. So let's see, I'm, I'm currently looking in Sweden, my email is this, you won't be able to see it by the way, but I'll type it in. I actually forgot my password for the account, so um, I won't be able to log in to today's tutorial. But basically when you log in, it's, it will be, you will have to allow a few things, basically you will get a captcha where you will have to allow a few things. I just want to say that Streamlabs take, takes a little bit of the money that gets donated to you, because it's obviously their website that you're using, so... If you, for example, get donated one dollar, then they will take like I think thirty to forty percent of that dollar. But anyways, uh, basically after you do that, it should say it should say your PayPal account is connected under this tab here. And uh, as you can see, you can connect other other sort of payment methods, also like Skrill Unit Pay. I'm not sure actually what these are. Like uh, credit cards, you cannot do this unless you are a big and recognized streamer by Streamlabs as you see here look here for security reasons credit card donations are only available for verified accounts and verified account accounts on it on Streamlabs are like pretty big and major streamers I think I'm not actually sure how this works but uh, you want to have a PayPal now when you have your payment method done you want to go to the settings the, the donation settings for your website so currency, you choose which currency you want to be made to be the main currency on that will be displayed on your streaming page or your donation page. I think you can change this custom to any any the to basically any currency you want. Uh, but if you but yeah, I I suggest that you have either USD or pounds, British pounds. Uh, anyways, you choose which one we want. Then you, here you can select your minimum amount of donations. So. If you don't want to get like spam donations, the spam donators that are like trolls, uh, then you can change the minimum amount to like five or something. If you don't care about the size of the money really, then you can have it in one. I like to have it in one because I appreciate any any amount of money. So here you can change the maximum message len length, and this is because you can you can basically type a message that will be displayed on the screen uh, on the alert. 
so so uh, you can change how long the message is maximum uh, be able to be you can have it on a de default 255 login required this uh you, you want to have this checked if you if you really want to make sure that your donations are real and they will not charge them back um but if you don't care really you just want to do make the process well, much as smooth as it can get then have this unchecked if you really want to make sure that there are real donations then have it checked so this is up to you suggested amount this is the amount that will be display on this on your page that will be basically your suggested amount that they should donate and uh, th this you I, I, suggest, I suggest that you have it on the default one five dollars tipping presets enabled this well, there will be like presets where you can just click on them and it will it will basically take you to that amount then you can just click on donate uh, yeah uh, so uh, yeah this is also something that I suggest that you have on the default ones and here you can uh, type in your your custom presets if you want to if you don't didn't, don't want to have these ones obviously preferred lingo this is not really a big a big setting over here this is basically what it should say a tip donation or a custom word because some people tend to prefer tip over donation and some people some people prefer to say donation over tip and uh, if you don't want to say any of them so you can select a custom word and just type it in you know um, but I, I like donation but depends on what you want what you like to say obviously the settings under here you don't basically have them on the default settings you don't need to change anything unless you want to I'll add some bad words that words that can't be used in the message of your donations uh, But otherwise don't have anything more or don't change anything more I forgot to say that you have to save the settings by scrolling all the way down to the, to the bottom of the page and hit save settings But here you can see your donations page so if you so we cop if you copy this and and paste it into Google you sh this will take you to your tip page or to your donations page. As you can see now, it, since I didn't add a PayPal account, I th it won't. It will look like this. Uh, but if we go to my actually my real donations page, which it, which is this is how it will look like if you add your PayPal account. If you don't add it, like it will look like this, obviously, because I didn't, did, I couldn't log into my PayPal account. But here. But this is how it will look like. You can add your username, custom with username, type in whatever whatever you want to donate, and you can also change the currency to whatever. As I said before, message. You can type random message over here. Also, and the funny thing here is that you can choose which like alert video or GIF that should be that should be shown on the pay, on the stream. So if you donated this 1,324 USD, uh, you can uh, like choose, I don't know, maybe you want this one. Oh wow. And then you click on donate uh, and this and this will basically take you to the PayPal, to the PayPal page where you log in and stuff. And then the donation will be sent to the, to the streamer that you want to donate to. So that, that is how the, the website works basically. Um, and here and here there's also a little page or a little leaderboard where you see the top the top tips or the top donators of all time of all of this week or after month no one donates to me I'm, I'm lonely also guys I forgot to say one thing if you want the donation alerts to be shared with two different channels so let's say you stream on both twitch and YouTube for some reason or something like that then you can go to account settings, this tab, and merge your Twitch account to Streamlabs. Or then basically you have linked both the accounts to Streamlabs. As you saw before, here is your donation website link uh, under here, which is uh, here is it sh should say your page. You can uh, click on it and it should, it should take you here. You can um, basically, if, when you're done with it, you just copy it. And I'd suggest that you go to your Twitch channel and create a panel for donations or where you can donate. So we edit a panel and go over to my to my donation panel, which is right here. Donate. Um, if you you can have it under here like this, but a, a, be, a much better thing, I'd suggest is just have 
have it here that the, that the picture uh, links that you can just click on the picture or the panel and it will take you to the to your donation page and they can just the, the the whole process is a lot smoother they can just basically donate a few dollars to you in only a few clicks basically just send this save it and um i'll show you how it works you go down to your panels and click on it click on the panel donate boom it takes you to your website which is here so if this helped guys if it didn't please make sure you subscribe to the channel and like the video that would mean very much with that said see you next video storks out